welcome to my very first vlog slash week in my life slash very first YouTube video ever. I have a very exciting week this week. I'm gonna be getting my hair done, so I'll take you along for that. Today, I have something very exciting in the works. I'm gonna be working with Live Nation. They invited me to the ITZY concert. It's in October, but for right now, they invited me to go see this billboard that they put up in downtown Phoenix, and they asked me to make a TikTok for them and take pictures in front of it and go check it out. So I'm gonna pick up my boyfriend right now and we're gonna go do that. Here we go. So I took some videos and pictures and here are the stories that I posted for them. It was really windy and 113 degrees, so we didn't stay out there very long. Afterwards, we just got some food, and then I did a quick fit check. Then we went home to our son. There he is in his little pouch. Isn't he the cutest? She's cute too. Um, okay. I just got to the hair salon, and I'm running late, so let's go inside. Today, I'm getting rid of the pink, sadly. It faded really fast. So we're gonna go all black today. Let's go. Here I am speed walking inside. Here's how my hair looked before. My roots were really grown out, my bangs are really long, and the color was just really faded. Then they just put the black dye on, let it sit for 15 minutes, and here I am in the middle of it getting styled. I'm all done now. Going back to my car. Oh man, it's so hot. Oh my god, I look so different. <laughs> I'm literally not used to having dark hair anymore. It's so weird. I feel like I have a wig on. I love it. It was hard to say bye to the pink, but it was just really hard to keep up with. My hair looks so shiny. It's getting long. I'm trying to grow it out. Dax can come over and help me take pictures. I'm doing something for my birthday. Got a cute little outfit and bought some little decorations. I'm just gonna take them at home. It'll be really cute. I think I'm gonna redo my makeup. I have an idea. A pink with like rhinestones in the crease. I bought like a rhinestone kit on Amazon. And so I wanna try and do that. And then, yeah, we'll take the pictures. I'll show you guys how they come out too. That's all, goodbye. Here's my outfit by the way. So cute. Love it. What the hell? Okay, let's pin these back a little bit. I already have makeup on, but I think I'm gonna take the eyeshadow off and put pink from this palette. I'm trying to leave my eyeliner on. And then I'll probably just put like foundation on my eyelids. What is that? Oh, it's dye. <laughs> I'm gonna cover that up a little bit. I'm gonna use this bright pink. I think I'm just gonna put it all over my lid. Cute. This eyeshadow is so good. It was only like, I think it's under $10, but it has a lot of colors in it. Pretty pigmented. I think that's enough. Oh my god. <laughs> a little bit crazy. Touch up my eyeliner a little bit. I've been using brown eyeliner lately. I feel like it's less harsh. On me, at least. I don't know if that makes sense. Maybe it's just because it's a pencil liner. I used to use a liquid liner. That one's pretty good. It's by NYX. And I'll probably do some inner corner highlight. Again, this palette is NYX. NYX is very underrated. I feel like they're, the quality of their stuff is like really good for the price. Let's make it super shiny. I guess I'll put the rhinestones on now. This is the rhinestone kit. Where's my little tool? Came with this little tool that picks them up. Pretty easy to put on. I use eyelash glue. This is just a Sephora eyelash glue. I wish I had a white one. This one's black, but as long as I don't put too much, it doesn't really show or anything. I'm gonna use this light pink one. Can someone tell me how this works? I don't understand how it like picks it up because it's not like sticky. I don't know, I don't get it. Anyways, I'm gonna put one in the inner corner. It's definitely not even, but it's fine. I pick up a little rhinestone there like that. I just hold it there for a little bit. 
on this side. That's kind of cute with just one. Okay, we'll keep going. I think I'm gonna do this for the Stray Kids concert too, but with green. It's coming out so good! I'm proud of myself. A special gift. Mm -hmm. Na -na -na. Ta -da. Okay. Yay. Like that? Yeah. Just things over it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here's what we have set up so far. And here are all the decorations I got on Amazon. So cute. Why does it look like that? It doesn't even like go in my head right. What if you like cut the straps off? It just looks weird. It though. does look weird. I don't like it. Like Would this be cuter? Probably. Ta-da. He's cute. Should I light them? No, that's dangerous. <laughs> that's so cute, to be honest. EBH. Yay! Here's the final look! Oh my gosh, so cute! It's the first of the month! You know what that means. Gotta change my calendar. Let's see what next month is. Yes. My boyfriend's sister made me this. It has my cat in different animes. Let me show you some other ones. This one's pretty funny. There he is. <laughs> They're all petting him. Hi. It's my birthday today. I'm just finishing getting ready. Nothing too crazy is happening today. Oh, my bed's a mess. And we're not really doing anything today because we're probably going to celebrate next weekend when we're in California. I think we're going to go shoot some pictures in this outfit. It's for a post for Pepper Mayo. And then probably just chill the rest of the day. Before I go, I did get some PR packages today. And so I figured I would unbox them now and show you guys what I got. They're stolen. Fancy. This is from Armani Beauty. They wrote me a little letter. Oh, wow. My life is crazy. Yeah, they sent me their new lipsticks. They sent me four shades. I'll open one just to see. I'll most likely post an unboxing on TikTok. Oh my god, look at the packaging. I love it. It's insane. Oh wow. Yeah. So cool. Thank you to Armani. I got a couple yesterday. I did already open them, but I'll show you anyways. This one was from Margiela. Amazing. I already opened it, but they sent me this little like Polaroid sleeve. The fragrance. It smells so good. I already have it out because I used it. <laughs> this is what the bottle looks like. You've probably seen these before. They're literally everywhere because they're that good. Oh my god. And then also got this package. It's from a small business um, based in LA. It's called Resalt. They sent me a cute little tank. Their logo right there. Really nice quality, which is great. And then they sent me these sweats. I love this. I love it. I love it. Love, love it. Again, amazing quality. Here's their little logo. Yeah, they're really nice. So I can't wait to wear those. And then I did get one more actually. This was Youth to the People. I've heard really good things about them. It is skincare. But yeah, they sent me all kinds of stuff. It has a list of everything in there and how to use it. So that's great. So thank you to those brands. Really excited. I always love getting PR. We'll see you guys later. I'm not sure if I'm gonna vlog a lot today just cause I don't really know what's happening yet, but we'll see. See you guys later. We ended up going to shoot some content. Here's my outfit it's from Pepper Mayo. We saw this church the other day driving by, so we decided to come back and shoot some pictures here. Then I just went and got my free drink at Dutch Bros, and then I asked my boyfriend if we could go to GameStop because I was looking for this Hello Kitty Squishmallow. Hey,
Oh, look, they have Steve. Nice. Should I get it? Should I get those two? Or just one? Oh. It's this one. It's pretty new still though. Yeah, I know. It's about $60. Yeah, I'll probably wait. And then we left. And here's the two that I got. This little panda and a little unicorn. So cute. And my boyfriend bought them for me. Thanks, babe. Then we just picked up some dinner and came home to our son again. And he was doing this weird thing with his leg when he scratched his butt. I don't know. And then we watched the Stray Kids movie. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.